Translation Dhritarashtra said, O Sanjaya, after assembling in the place of pilgrimage at Kurukshetra, what did my sons and the sons of Pandu do, being desirous to fight? Hmm. So, the history is that same family, uh, there was dispute, dispute who would occupy the throne. Dhritarashtra and uh, actually he was the eldest son of the king and next was Pandu. So every, every country uh, the law of private literature, what is called the eldest uh, child uh, in, in your country uh, if the eldest child is a girl, she also occupies the throne, just like present Queen Elizabeth, uh, formerly there was Queen Victoria, before that another Elizabeth. But uh, in India, uh, uh, Oman has no such right. Uh, the Oman is never given any responsible post. Uh, uh, that is the opinion uh, of uh, the greatest politician in the history of the world, Chanakya Pandit. According to his opinion, uh, Vishyasanaiva Kattabam Sri Suraja Kulesh. He has given his explicit opinion that you, you cannot trust with any responsible force uh, or any responsibility with uh, women and politicians. Those who are diplomat politicians, you cannot trust them. And so the general regula regulation is that women should remain under the protection of husband, uh, father, husband, and children. Just like this, Pandus, uh, their mother, Kunti, she was very, very qualified lady. But still, uh, after the death of her husband, she always remained uh, with the sons. The sons are going to the forest, the mother is also going. Also the wife is also going, uh, Draupadi. This was it. So two parties, Dhritarashtra, was the eldest son, but he was blind, bodily defective. Therefore, uh, he was not awarded the throne. His next brother, Pandu, he was offered the throne, but he died uh, very early age, a young man. When these Pandus, the five sons, Dhrishti Maharaj, at that time not Maharaj, Dhrishti, Bhim, Arjun, Nukul, Sahaja, they were very small children. So they were taken care of by Dhritarashtra and other elderly family, Bhishma Dev. He was the grandfather of the Pandos. He was the elder uncle of Dhritarashtra. Bhishma was elder brother of Dhritarashtra's father. He was so old. And he was actually, uh, the kingdom belonged to Bhishma, but he remained a brahmachari. He did not marry. There was no issue of Bhishma there. Therefore his nephews, uh, Dhritarashtra and Pandu, they were uh, 
in Erika. Now, after the death of Pandu, there was conspiracy. Uh, Vitharashtra wanted that actually this is my kingdom. Now, somehow or other I could not get it. Now my brother is there. Uh, so if I do not inherit, why not my sons? This was the politics. Uh, politics are always there. And envious, jealousy, this is the nature of this material world. We cannot avoid. The spiritual world means just the opposite. There is no politics, there is no jealousy, there is no enviousness, there is spiritual. And material world means politics, jealousy, diplomacy, enviousness, so many things. This is material. So, even in the heavenly planet, these things are there, politics. Even in animal kingdom, these politics are there. This is the nature. 